Hey kids, Brian Trauman here, Pez Through the Ages. We've got a Facebook page and a YouTube channel in a box here from John Lispina. Let's see what's inside this box. Well, I know what's inside the box. It's a big one. And first of all, we've got a couple of pens that I'm not going to use. Can you guys see? No, I'm off screen. Pez International, 35 Prindle Hill Road. P.O. Box 967, Orange, Connecticut. Write your Pez order with it. Maybe I will. Oh, for extra high profits. I should write my Pez order with it. And this one, no store is too small to sell Pez. Pez International, 5616 37th Avenue, Woodside, New York, 11377. It does sell 365 days a year. So I'm pretty sure these are the same... No, they're not. They're not the same pens at all. They're different pens. They're different bottom caps. This is yellow plastic with printing on it. This is clear plastic with a yellow cardboard insert. Um, the pen ink is long dry. I suppose I could replace the ink, but I'm not going to. I'm going to display these somewhere in the case. Uh, and not use them. So, uh, John Lespina has got some more of those if you're interested, and you too could have those. Now, here's something that's pretty cool that I'm pr I'm pretty excited to add to the collection. I've avoided getting this. I've had some opportunity to get this before, but it's large. But I thought it was larger. It smells a little funny. I'm gonna bring you guys down here a little bit. This comes from the Marianne Kennedy collection. Marianne Kennedy, known as Pez Head Zero, one of the first, or the first, real Pez collector. Uh, passed away last year, and John Lespina helping her family to sell the collection and doing a fantastic job. Uh, putting out parts at a time, uh, helping everybody understand the, the value of the Pez, the history behind the pieces, and uh, and Marianne's contribution to the uh, collecting community. Now this piece, I thought it was much bigger, and I always said, hey Brian, how are you gonna display this? And I, honestly, I still don't have a good idea of how I'm gonna display this. I'd like to fill it. But as you can see, this is about the size of a sheet of paper, or a really tall sheet of paper. And honestly, this is this is pretty much the the item right here. How do I... Hmm. I guess we do it like this. And the other item that's really important is this. Is this newspaper John's newspaper? Hold on a second. Or is it Marianne's newspaper? looks like John's newspaper. In which case, no offense, John, I guess I don't care, but it's Black Friday, which makes me think, since this is Cyber Monday or Tuesday, this is probably just John's newspaper. The, the concept, of course, can you guys see this? No. Hold on. How am I going to do this? How is it in the picture? It's not. All right. So I think I'm going to put this back together. Uh, there. Concept, I think, is I'll display it like this, and I could, I've got plenty of costumes. I don't have the box, or this particular box, but I could find the box to display here, and I put the dispensers, bunch of dispensers here, and, hmm, I don't know. It might have still been a bad idea. This will hold 36, 2, 4, 6, 8, 16, and then, let's see, 4, uh, yeah. So 36 dispensers and 100 Pez. 
That is tough. What am I going to do? Where will I put this? It's giant. Uh, I guess you guys could leave now, because I'm going to just... I mean, stick with me for a second if you really want to see something. I don't really know. Is that going to fit? It might fit. Right next to... Yeah, it might just barely fit if I slide it in next to one of these shelves. But then, of course, i got to get rid of something. I can get rid of some of the lunch boxes. <sighs> All right. Well, and then I need 36 vintage. Uh, if only I had... I'm going to check out some of these dispensers, guys. I've got to get a pink pony... The uh, pink elephant looks like another pink pony, a gray elephant, a couple of blue ponies. That's all doable, but a couple of pink ponies is going to be tough. But I think you'll forgive me if I fill it with other stuff. Is that a black elephant? Black elephant. All right. Well... All right, and I don't have 36 costumes, but I've, I can come close. Uh, and those are, well, all right, I got a challenge ahead of me. I think I could do it. I'll talk to you later.